Okay. Hi everyone, I'm Andre Rodriguez. Um, my username is Andres R on the websites. <laughs> That's maybe for my crystal. No, not really. But um, I just want to say that Microsoft um, introduced me to soft photography. I wouldn't be standing here if Microsoft wasn't, wasn't there. I always tried to sell my images, but it was really hard. So I was born with the industry, and I think I, I grew with the industry. And I learned uh, uh, many things along the way. And nowadays, I've been with Microsoft for six years. I have a portfolio of 25,000 images. I submit around 1,000 images a month. And I sell around 1,700 images a day, which is over 600,000 a year. Um, I am based in the UK, but I'm originally from Colombia, so I go back and forth. I, I shoot most of my stuff in Colombia. And then I do all the post-production and the retouching in, in the UK. I have five five full-time people in the UK and all the freelancers in Colombia looking for locations and models and setting up the, the productions. Okay, I'm going to talk about what's the current status from my point of view in, in Microsoft. I think um, quality and quantity are raising at a very high pace because the amount of people with digital cameras is just growing incredibly fast and they're getting accepted and accept, um, easier and easier. They're learning and the quality is rising. Um, copying is an issue. People tend to, because it was very easy to make good money out of every image a few months ago. It didn't matter how much money you put into a shoot, you knew you would get it back. So people were copying top sellers and uh, because of that we have too many similar images in the searches. I think I think creativity and originality is the key right now to make yourself stand out from the others. Um, yeah, as I said, repetition is becoming the rule. Many many contributors are just uploading the same as the top sellers, and that's not the way to go because buyers will get tired of seeing the same thing in the searches. Um, I think creativity should be rewarded by creativity uh, costs more than the, the average photo. You need more props, you need to invest more time into it, you need to retouch more, you need to, well, to make, create an original image and this should be rewarded as I said and I think um, some agencies are creating uh, higher price collections and this has raised the RPI per image and the RPI um, monthly. For example, the Beta Collection and I stock, Totally Infinite, all these kind of collections are really good for us because you can then differ differentiate the, um, the quality of your images. You decide where to put them. I think an, uh, another good thing to do now is uh, look for new ways of distribution. Uh, I'm gonna try. Well, uh, I'm developing my own my own website to sell my images and offer new products. Um, video. Well, we're gonna have a whole panel on video later on, but uh, I, I think video is a good way to maximize the profits from from a shoot. Because you, you have the location, you have the lighting, you have the models. So I'm trying to to do two hours of video, six hours of, of photos in, in every production. Um, I recently started with video. I'm, I'm not that experienced, but um, the RPI is at the moment a bit higher than photos. So I'm quite exact, excited with that. Um, the whole Microsoft industry has grown a lot now. We have third-party serv service providers. We have people managing workflows, uploading, uh, dealing with model releases, making it easier for us to, to upload since there are many agencies. 
and some of these these people are looks at an eye syndicate. I, I, I have tried both of them and I think they're quite helpful to to speed up the whole process of uploading images since we have so many agencies I distribute to twenty four agencies at the moment. So each of them require different different categories, different sizes sometimes, different um, color environments. Uh, for news and information for you for maybe some traditional photographers that want to look into going to Microsoft, I think Microsoft Diaries and Tyler's Microsoft Group are two really good sources because Microsoft is totally different from traditional. So you, you really need to understand it and read well to to know what what sells, um, what you should do with your with your images, how to retouch them in a certain way, maybe or or even the, your, your shooting style could be, could be different. Uh, we all know that the recession hit quite hard, and I think because of the recession and because of the, of the saturation of similar images, um, there is a point at the moment that we need to keep costs down to, to see a good revenue in the images. Um, my return per image has dropped. It used to be around eight, and now it's around five. My overall profit has gone up because I have uploaded a lot, but but it's still the returns per image has dropped. And I think it's also because um, good images that sold well at the beginning are gonna are gonna be there, and new images are finding it hard to to go up in the searches because. I mean, agencies are taking 100,000 images a day, a week, and to get a good image placed in the searches nowadays is, is, is a lot more difficult than, than before. Whereas, if you get good sales, if you got good sales, good sales at the beginning, buyers are just going to go search by downloads, find it, and, and it will stay there because of that. Um, I'm doing tighter edits. I'm gonna, I'm gonna totally change the, the way I'm, I manage my business at the moment. I'm just gonna concentrate on quality, create stuff that isn't there. And um, yeah, that's more or less the status of the, of the business from my point of view. So that's it for me. Thank you.